hey, I still have like so many minutes. I have less than 15 minutes to walk to the cinema. I don't know where it is, so I have to search for it. Well, meanwhile, enjoy the view and also give me some company. I've only went to cinema like alone before, only once. So this is my second time in um, in like 10 years. It's special, it's special. You have to try it. If you want to go for cinemas like alone, don't go for the movies where it's jam-packed with families and couples. No, that's that's weird, you know, with less crowd. It's a great experience, in my opinion. If you have done that, tell me about that in the comment section. The clock is ticking. I mean, I have to go be there before 8.30. Can you see that glow? Amazing view. And the sun setting here. We are in front of the cinema, I think. My man, look at me. It's close to 8.30 and I'm in front of the cinema. That's me. That's what I always do. I'm not early nor late. Always perfectly on time. See, I'm not the guy who is interested in those Ferraris, those Lamborghinis and stuff, or those Teslas. I'm interested in these kind of cars. They're amazing. They have those vintage style. The cinema is upstairs. Hey, look at that. Try that one day. Clara avait 21 ans, mais c'est pas parce que les médias s'y sont pas intéressés qu'il faut pas s'en occuper. Nobody's here. Mais c'est des tués. Moi je sais, je vais vous dire. À la PJ, on raconte que chaque enquête tournait dans la tête jusqu'à l'obsession. Ah, ça vous bouffe de l'intérieur. Maintenant, arrête-toi. Ça vous dévore. I turned off the camera, but I think I have to film this. It's beautiful at the night here. We got people dancing and stuff. And we got a fountain here. Ah, it should be really refreshing at night during this summer. Well, let's get a closer look. We have to get going because I have some things to share about this movie. So it was a... I came home really late that night so I didn't get the time to resume my overall experience of this movie and I wanted to say it's that it's a movie which is called Iravan Nenal 
is a Tamil film. Let's start with the positive things. Well, the movie is amazing. It's the it's the world's first non-linear one-shot film. You might not know what that means. One-shot film. Well, it means that you start the production of the film, which means you start to film the film and you don't turn off the camera you just go through the whole story and movies like this already exist like for example and many other examples but in this case this is non-linear which means for example Christopher Nolan's Dunkirk is linear it's it follows the events on its but on this order you know there's no flashbacks it doesn't go back in time it follows the events one after another but in this case the non-linear format is when there's flashbacks for example in this movie the character goes well we see the story of a man since his birth and we follow him through the struggles he goes through. So you cannot put the older version of him when he's four years old, right? So those are flashbacks. And in those cases, they did some intelligent, amazing, how would I say, techniques to tell the story. But as I said, they turned on the camera and they didn't turn off until the end. They shot the whole film on one day and they shot it like 23 times as you guessed it's not always easy you don't turn on the camera and like finish the movie at the whole movie in one day just like that without errors so at some point we we even see the making of the movie because this movie is like one hour or something and the first half for the first half of it it's like they're going to be showing you the making of it's really really, really interesting okay this is a new experience and you shouldn't miss it okay if you ever get the chance to watch this movie i say this will be worth it there's some instances where they film like for one hour for one and a half hours straight and the camera just like tilts unexpectedly and Guess what? They have to reshoot for another day. And they prepared for like 90 days of rehearsal. And the set and building of this. They are going to be explaining all this and the making of. But I'm going to say it anyway. I'm trying to give you the desire to watch this masterpiece. That's what I'm trying. So, oh, they, they say that it took two years to build those sets. So we are going to be traveling to different timelines, right? Like past, future, yeah, past, present, and the future. And the sets, there's going to be many different locations, right? So how do you do that if you don't turn off the camera and you want to shoot the entire film at one check? For that, I'm not going to ruin it. Go watch the movie. It's a beautiful experience. You are not going to regret it at all. Maybe you don't understand the language Tamil. There's subtitles, so I, I mean, it's worth it to experience it, even though you don't understand the language. This is not like a review or something. This is who am I to give a review on this beautiful cinematic adventure? I'm just someone who fell in love with the passion of this director his name is Radha Krishna Parthivan and the passion he has for cinema is this is the world's first non-linear one-shot film so watching this movie you are taking part of an important event in the world cinema history so yeah I'm going to leave you at that. Go watch this movie. It's worth it. And also, don't forget... Uh, 
accept my friend request by clicking that subscribe button.